Hello, Flavio, welcome to my sister. Who reviews? And they review some of the anime series Unity. And in this uh, uh Kara is off going well about to go to uh Metropolis and see just really excited since he finds a small little bit boring and doesn't really think there's uh, anything to, to being uh, normal. He knows he has a a few friends, and I do like the same when uh, one of her friends named uh, Alan uh, just shows up and gives, gives her a comic book to read. And uh, Ron Paul Kent had to advise her to just be nice to him, even when I, uh, even when he asked if he's if he's got a got a postcard to him. I had another good scene when uh, he's doing her sh shorts. I just see super speeds getting the eggs from the chickens and getting the milk from the cow. Yeah. Yeah, no. Um, the card does actually, uh, as a postcard to Ma Pa. Can't just say what's been uh, up to. And the other person, the barber. In this, so we're getting to uh, take place uh, sometime after a uh, girl's night out, so good continuity, I think. And that's he fights uh, Volcana. Uh, I didn't think Volcana was just, like a, a last little villain, I think it's just, just like a, a mercenary that was made by the government. But when with the end of the first episode of World Talks World, it was stayed where it's a man. Uh, left her, but whatever. And yeah, Carol was uh, upset. So she had to go back to uh, Dolesville, as he calls it. And yes, yes, yeah, he leaves the bus because he's finding people annoying. Him, especially this uh, couple who is later revealed might be the Langs. Or the Langs. He was just, just discussing the. If they have a, a turnip or a peach. Yeah. So, uh, Carlos super speeds, uh, home. And he finds that uh, there's something weird, uh, going on since something seems off and her cat, uh, Streaky, is, uh, just acting a bit more violent to Ma Pa Kent. And, uh, she finds there's it's a new uh, either church or cult in a uh, smallville led by uh, this guy named the uh, uh, Reverend uh, Howling. Uh, I was a howler. I don't do do a howl. Uh, yeah, it turns out the uh, he's infecting the citizens of Smallville with this uh, thing called. A unity. Um, when a superhero tries to fight him, the other the residents has to uh, get the tentacles out of their mouths to try and attack her. And when he does that, he get lands some punches on the howler. It, it actually uh, hurts uh, the other uh, people as well. And that's he brings uh, Ma Kent to the. Hospital where a clerk or Superman shows up. And um, yeah, Mokan gets out of the uh, translate state uh, at one point and calls the Supergirl and Superman, Clark, and Kara beg for help. And from the doctors. Yeah, yeah, it would take the doctor request now, would you? Mm. And of course, uh, Carter's been a uh, guilty since he did see a uh, good rev coming out of the bus when she was heading to Metropolis and just thinking that she stayed might be able to uh, stop him sooner. But the monster is sure that he couldn't have uh, done uh, anything. I'm guessing he's just implying that if uh, she was actually there when uh, the reverend showed up, she'd probably get. Uh, taken over as well. 
um, the Wall Street Panther said, testing, or just said, looking at this, uh, piece of, uh, the, the tentacle that came out from a candle under a microscope, and that uh, car was waiting for the doctor's results. Yeah, they get infected, and someone's gonna figure out that the, the tentacle is, a uh, we, we get to, uh, x-rays, so that's how they defeat the creature with the x-ray vision. I guess what are turned out to go Rev is a uh, the creature known as Unity. He has a six eyed giant uh, tentacle monster. And I think I remember again one of the characters saying it was from a, a planet that's similar to the one that the collector from Main Man was from but eh, can't remember. Uh, yeah, there's a, a big fight sequence with uh, Superman and Supergirl using the X-ray vision on a uh, Unity. And that's what to do defeat it with a uh, tank and Superman go back to Metropolis and the uh, Supergirl does that tell him uh, uh, Mom Pa Kent what happened and Zito said thinking that normal in there so bad now since he's gone off to uh, the comic store to see uh, Alan, or the own, I can't forget. And, uh, yeah, that's about it. And I think it's a good episode. I do got like a, a car's reaction to the, uh, the, the, the car in the comic book that says Spider Powers. Yeah, but you know, that's a Spider Man reference. Hmm. And yeah, I think, uh, the car the voice actress was that better in in this than uh in the loss and does the character does it better since I don't think he's been causing the as much said damage as uh, last time. And she was learned that in Rieta bad staying in in the middle of nowhere and does that relaxing at some points. Um Re Reverend uh Howler, Howling, or whatever. He's creepy. He just wants to smile when he, when he sees his teeth. It's just... Ugh. And he can't tell he's a priest or the way he looks. Well, either a priest or a farmer. It's a bit like uh, the... The farmer from the Batman... Or the new Batman Adventures at uh, Critters. But... I'm probably just uh, saying things. And, uh, otherwise, uh, music... Good and uh, I just wonder if uh, so we're actually call Clark in Metropolis to tell him what's going on or how's that going to come to Smallville another way, but you know. And uh, yeah, I think it's a good episode, and that could be the two part season finale where some of be experiencing. Probably the worst day of his life. Yeah, might be might be his worst day, but it's a great episode. Mm. I mean, eh, it's like that. I'll see you guys later.